Well, it come to me in a dream. See, I was sitting out in the railroad yard watching the trains go by. The train stopped and these three hobos got off. They told me they had come from Nazareth and was on their way to Jerusalem. They had three candles. They gave me one, told me to light it and to be careful that it didn't go out. Next thing you know, I was standing in front of this house. A voice told me to knock on the door. This old woman came to the door and told me that they had been waiting on me. She led me into this room. It was a big room. It was full of all different kind of people. They looked like everybody else except they had sheep heads. And they were making noises like sheep make. Then I heard somebody call my name. I looked around, it was the same three hobos. They told me to take off my clothes. They gave me a blue robe with gold thread. They washed my feet, combed my hair. Then they, 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 they showed me three doors and told me to pick one. I walked through them doors and the, and the flame leapt off that candle. It seemed like my whole head caught fire. I looked around and it was four or five other men with the same blue robes on. Then we heard a voice say, look out across the valley. So we looked out across the valley and we saw that it was full of wolves. And the voice said, somebody had to take those sheep people you saw in the other room across on the other side of the valley. I said, here I am, send me. That's when I met Jesus. He said, if you go, I'll go with you. And just when I was about to say, well, come on, let's go. That's when I woke up. And it seemed like my head was still on fire, but I had a piece about myself that was hard to explain. That's when I know I was filled with the Holy Ghost. He was chose to be a servant of the Lord. It took me a long time to accept that. And in a lot of ways, God showed me it was the truth. That's when I became a preacher. 